Welcome to this episode on how to create a simple drop down box in Rails. I was uh, looking for a way to just uh, display numbers 1 to 10 or some lower bound upper bound values and as I was looking at the um, documentation I found the simple thing of generating a drop down with just integers it was not I could not find anything and I came across this blog post this guy has a nice helper that does what I was looking for and I believe a powerful framework like Rails should allow us to create some simple drop down box like this and it's a good opportunity for you guys to contribute to Rails just watch this uh, contributing to Rails with Git by Ryan Bytes and I'll show you how to create this simple helper and you can use this example uh, for the documentation you can just copy paste in the when you create the documentation and also follow the screencast to see how we can contribute so here is a chance for you to become a Rails score contributor so let's get started I have a project here and this project I uh, went through one of the previous episodes I showed you how we can have multiple selection I have added a few more things uh, just uh, related to the drop-down box books controller is the same I have added a rating which is of type integer to the books table and I have uh, initialized the rating for the books when I create them in the migration so the first step is let's uh, throw the uh, helper into the application helper so the first one is the object and column is the attribute of that particular active record object start value and the end value for the drop down box and if you provide the selected some value that option will get selected while looping through it we generate this okay it's very simple so let's uh, move on to the step two and in this step we will add a rating attribute in the not in the partial in the form partial let's put it here so we have a ratings and we just call the helper book is the object rating is the attribute start value is 1 end value is 10 and we want whatever was selected in that particular book as the rating to be selected when the edit form loads and for us to see if it's working or not we will also modify the show and put the rating here so we can see what's going on okay now let's start the server Here is the server for the store. I've already run the migration. We have the new schema. Now let's just start the server. I want to check if it's already running. Now the server is running. Let's load one of the books. There it is. Rating is 4. Let's uh, make it uh, 8 and do an update for presentation Zen. 
and there it is presentation Zen is now 8 when you load the form again the same uh, same book again it should display the drop down box with 8 as selected and there it is and if you go back it's 8 so here's opportunity for you guys to contribute to Rails go ahead and give it a try and that's it for the screencast and if you enjoyed it please recommend me on working with Rails thank you